Hello folks and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Aaron Ryan back with you once again. Alright, so I've done a video on this before but a lot has changed on Facebook lately. So, you're probably a gamer on Facebook and you're probably wondering how do I keep my live streams on Facebook without them expiring? Well, I'm going to show you right now. Alright, so as I did mention, uh, a lot has changed since the last video I've done and um, the method that I've done uh, that I showed you in the previous video no longer works now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the method now, the proper method, and uh, maybe it's just a new way of doing it. I hope um, nothing changes now because me, I do like um, keeping my streams on my Facebook gaming page, but uh, there's two ways to do this, okay? two ways number one the first way of doing it is just go into your gaming page mine for example is aaron ryan gaming here all you gotta do just scroll down to the video that you want to um keep so for example my latest stream here is august 8th and i played rainbow islands for the sega masters master system I can't talk today so all you gotta do click on your video okay you click pause and over here on the side here, you're going to see something called view more video details. You're going to click on that, okay? Now this is going to take you somewhere else. Okay, so don't worry about that. You're going to get here a new look for video details. So you're going to click got it on here. Now, as you see on the left hand side here, you see edit post. So click on edit post right here on the left hand side. Now, this will bring you into this place, which was on the last video I've done. But the method on the last video no longer displays this. So this is the only method here to actually display this menu here. So when you're in this menu here, you can make some changes if you want. You can do the title, edit the title again. You can put in the description. You can change anything here. But down below, this is the button you're very, you want to go to. That is going to say expiring so you're going to click on that and you're going to put on published make sure it's on published and then click on save you've also the option here to download the video as well download in hd or in sd as well so you're going to click on save and that's it the video will no longer expire on your channel okay Will no longer expire now the other way is into creator studio okay so um when you finished up your stream go back into your creator studio on the right hand side here on creator profile just below strikes and violations you're going to see something here called expiring streams now your video is going to appear here your live stream will appear in here now you have the option here as well to save it if you want and we'll go into the save tab here, which I have here. Rainbow Wellness is saved and there's all the rest of the streams as well that I've clicked save on as well. So they're all going to be saved. So you don't have to worry about all your streams getting expired. I've seen comments coming into me as well and um, I'm trying to help people as much as I can. And I'm seeing some comments saying um, that they're here because my streams have now expired or all my um, streams are gone from my gaming page. So. I do hope this method do help you out. Uh, do let me know in the comments below if does if this does help you out, okay? Because this is the only method that I know anyway that works. And I have have I actually have all my streams since um when was the first live stream I done? Let me see. Go into videos here. Scroll all the way down. As you can see, they're all still there. All of them, every single one of them are there. I think it was January 30th, January 29th, or was it the 1st of February, or... I'm going to have a look now and see. But they're all there. I'm going to keep scrolling down here. But it is, it is a pain, you know, to have um, put in a lot of work and effort into your streams, and then for Facebook then to kind of just expire them where they're no longer allowed or viewable anymore, you know? Like me, I like looking back on my old streams to see how far I've become and what kind of games I played before and if I'm going to play the same game again, I don't want to make the same mistake again. Yeah, there we go. Very fun world. January 30th, yeah. January 30th and all of them are still there. They're all still viewable to everybody that comes into my page so they can watch back on previous streams 
So just to recap again, okay? Just to recap, so you go back into your gaming page, you go into the video, your latest stream or whichever streams you want to keep. Just click on the video, go into it, and then on the side here, view more video details. It's going to take you away from the page for a minute, but it's going to bring you into this brand new little video details. Click got it. Left hand side, edit post. And then down the very bottom there, it'll say expiring, but you click on publish and save and you're done. And again, recap again into Creator Studio, right hand side, it'll say expiring streams in here, expiring soon. All you got to do there, then just click on save, save the streams and they will be on your Facebook gaming page there for everybody to uh, to watch back, for you to watch back as well at any time, okay? So I do hope this helps you out, okay? Let me know in the comments below if this helps you out, okay? And um, if you need any more help with something, uh, feel free to ask, and uh, I'd be glad to help you out, okay? So uh, thanks very much for watching, and uh, thank you for subscribing as well. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button, and I'll talk to you in the next stream, okay, folks? Bye-bye. Take care.